Model Amber Rose reveals her ideal man is an atheist. Famous American model Amber Rose recently posted on her Instagram that her ideal is, ideal man is, quote, definitely an atheist, but also a feminist. In an Instagram story, Amber Rose said, quote, why is it so hard to find an intelligent, sexy, rich, successful, tatted gentleman that also has kids but is not an abusive narcissist? The first part of the post seemed relatable, but the second part is what raised people's eyebrows. Quote, and he's definitely an atheist, but also a feminist. I'm not asking for much, her post continued. Her statement sparked a debate on social media about atheists and dating. A lot of people expressed their disappointment online. Some even mentioned that her lack of faith is causing her relationship problems. After all the criticism, Amber Rose doubled down on her statement, saying, I said what I said. <laughs> this isn't the first time Amber Rose was embroiled in controversy over atheism. She had previously stated that she doesn't believe in God and even commented that Jesus dying on the cross for humanity's sins is, quote, manipulative. What absolute crybabies. Imagine if somebody got offended, like, oh, I want my man to be Christian or Muslim. Imagine if we there was an outrage by atheists, like, oh, you want your significant, you want your husband to be a Christian? How dare you? Like, that, like this is like one of those indications about how much hate and discrimination exists against atheists. It's a like, huge double seen... standard. Yeah, so like imagine, okay. This would have been headline news if the outrage was after she said, I want to, like, I want, I'm a Jew and I want my significant other to also be a Jew. Imagine if there was, like, she was flooded with outrage. This would be headline news. You know what I mean? This would be a much more viral news. But if you say the same thing, if the outrage is over atheists, people are like, we just have, like, this. how big of a deal was this? Was this, like, major? Did this go viral? I mean... Uh, to the like in celebrity gossip sites or whatever, whatever. Yeah, it would be beyond celebrity gossip. It would be like on Reuters. It would be on CNN. It would be everywhere. If this was outrage, I don't know. I just think like there's a lot more tolerance towards people being outraged over hatreds towards atheists than towards other people. Do you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think Anyways, it's kind thank, of funny thank you for doubling down. Thank you I so much for doubling that. I think Amber Rose was this such an the best promotion. atheist, actually. Like, that's the mm -hmm. other thing I wanted to talk about, because for so people don't know, Amber Rose is famous because she dated Kanye West, and then she was married to rapper Wiz Khalifa, and she's always, you know, been in, in celebrity circles, celebrity orbits, blah, 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 like run-ins with the Kardashians, like all this stuff. Um and she's also famous because she started the slut walk in Los Angeles, which then became like a national and international thing to protest against slut shaming and RAPE culture. And so she's also has an activist and is very sex positive. And so I didn't know that she had was so outspoken on this issue. What I find kind of funny is that a lot of the backlash against her for this is also colored with the fact that she's a sex worker. So even before she was dating rappers and stuff, like she was a stripper. And then nowadays she has an OnlyFans and she's been doing that for a while. And so a lot of people were coming at her from that angle of being like, oh, of course you're gonna have problems with men. Like the father of her youngest child um, like cheated on her with like 12 different women. You know, because, oh, you are a whore, basically. And so the only man that would want you in this context is going to treat you poorly because he doesn't have, like, the respect that is obligated upon him by religion, essentially. So, I don't know. There, There's also, like, a like an anti-sex work, like, slut-shaming aspect to this as well. <clears throat> oh, okay. I see, I see, I see. Well, atheists and sex workers together, we will unite and fight against discrimination. And in, in fact, maybe atheist sex workers is the way that we could promote tolerance towards atheists. <laughs> don't, don't ask me how. <laughs> don't ask me how. I mean, hey, that's one. That's one angle. Um, I think. Oh, I had another point I wanted to make. I can't remember what it was. I don't know. 
Oh, never mind. Get my best-selling book, Why There Is No God, for free. Click on the link for it in the description.